Hey guys, it's Chef from Omega. We get a lot of questions from people about process controllers versus safety limit controllers. Well, stick around because we're going to break it down for you right here. Let's say you have a high temperature control application like a kiln, an industrial oven, or a blast furnace and you need a fail-safe way of limiting the temperature in the event of a system failure. Well, a safety limit controller can protect expensive heaters and sensitive materials from hazardous overheating conditions. I know what you're probably thinking, I already have a temperature controller in my process. Why do I need a safety limit controller? Well, a temperature controller is designed to control temperature without extensive operator involvement. A temperature controller in this system will accept a temperature sensor as an input and compare the actual temperature to the desired set point. It'll then provide an output to a control element which will automatically make adjustments to maintain the desired temperature level. Well, that's all well and good when things are operating normally. What if something goes wrong with the process? Well, that's where a safety limit controller comes in. A safety limit controller is an on-off controller with a latching output, meaning if the preset temperature is exceeded, the system will quickly shut down, requiring a manual reset to change it back. Safety limit controllers are typically used as redundant controllers to shut down a process when undesirable limits are reached and since they require a manual reset, this ensures that an operator is aware of the conditions immediately. And in some high temperature industrial applications, a safety limit controller is not only recommended, it's required by the National Fire Protection Association. So don't set yourself up with a half-baked temperature control system. For a relatively low cost, a safety limit controller can save you a lot of trouble in the long run. For more information on safety limit controllers, click the link in the description below or call or chat live with us on Omega.com. Thanks for watching and be sure to like and subscribe.